Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we will try to understand distance vector routing algorithm part 3. So, the first part and the second part in our previous videos, we have discussed clearly about the algorithm, the steps of algorithm and how to find the routing tables at each and every router. How to, uh, how to get the routing tables at each and every router by using the algorithm in a clear way. If you haven't watched that video, please watch those videos and come back here. And every video in our channel is going to be part of entire course or a playlist. Our suggestion is to follow the entire course so that you can have a better understanding of the concepts and the link for the playlist is provided in the description below now coming to this class we'll try to understand so uh, there we have discussed about lots of steps to uh, to get the routing table in the router but it is very simple to get uh, uh, the things uh, by by seeing this uh, uh, um, network we can easily get the routing tables on the routing uh, routing tables on the router very easily and uh, uh, in, in competitive exams like gate and uh, 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 any other competitive exams so you may not be the questions asked or does not uh, 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 they belong to the so the questions are in such a way so that we have to generate these tables and on these tables after generating the tables the questions we have, we have to solve the questions so that is the way the questions will be asked in the competitive exams and they are the graphs so these uh, um, networks or the graph of the network diagram will be very simple uh, graphs like this so they will be they are going to ask very simple graphs like this and this this uh, so we will try to understand we'll try to execute these uh, 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 tables routing tables by simply by seeing this diagram and it is very simple math so directly by seeing and uh, finding all the paths we can fill these tables uh, the values in the tables so why I am saying this is after generating the tables the questions the questions that are asked in the competitive exams or in such a way first we have to generate these tables and after that we have to apply the question okay so first generate we'll try to generate the routing table final routing tables okay so no more three or four or five steps uh, so as we are having uh, four nodes uh, it is not required to do uh, three iterations or three steps to to get executed okay so now at a at a to a it is uh, zero and it is a it is very trivial and the next one is a to b a to b the possibilities are this is one of the possibility 2 and this is another possibility 4 plus 9 13 and the other possibility is 13 so the best path is uh, from a to b so the distance is 2 uh, uh, and uh, the next path is uh, so the next half is uh, hop is b and similarly a to c a to c means this way it is not possible uh, this is another way so it is uh, 12 plus 4 16 9 plus 1 uh, 4 plus 9 plus 1 uh, 13 plus 1 14 and the other possibility is a to c means it is uh, to b and to c and the distance is 3 so a to c the distance is 3 and the next hop is b and uh, a to d a to d is uh, this is one possibility this is another possibility 12 plus 1 13 13 plus 2 uh, 15 and 9 plus 2 11 and this is directly 4 so it is 4 and the option is uh, d and the next one is uh, uh, this table at b uh, it is a to uh, b to e a b to a is this is one of the possibilities so directly i am going to solve it and the next hop is a b to b is 0 and the next hop is b b to c b to c is 1 and the next hop is c b to d b to d 9 uh, 2 and 4 6 1 and uh, 12 13 so it is 6 and the next hop is b to d next hop is a okay and uh, c uh, this is the table on c router c uh, c to a c to a means this is one of the possibility and this is 3 so c to a is 3 and the next hop is b c to b c to b this is 1 and the next hop is b c to c is 0 and the next hop is c c to d c to d is 12 
and this one is 1 2 4 1 2 4 3 plus 7 and this is 1 plus 9 uh, it is 10 so the possibility is 1 2 4 1 2 4 is 7 and for C to D the next hop is B so we have to go here and uh, it will uh, it will be passed to this this and this one and similarly at router D uh, how the uh, table is going to be at A uh, starting uh, from D to A D to A the possibility is this is one of the possibility and uh, the other one is this and this the other one is this and this among this the four is the smallest one four and the next hop is A immediately connected D to B D to B means 4 plus 2 6 uh, 12 plus 1 13 9 so among these 6 is the smallest one and the next hop is a a okay and the next one is uh, uh, d to c d to c d to c 12 uh, 10 4 7 d to c is 7 and the next hop is again a d to d so it is 0 and it it will stay on d okay so this is how we can simply take uh, less than a minute and we can generate uh, these tables uh, 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 very fastly and on these tables they are going to ask the questions so how those questions will be that we, we will solve lots of gate problems at the end of this section so based of based these questions are also we're going to solve so this is how uh, we have to be very fast while solving the competitive exams like gate hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below and if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching